welcome to the first vlogmas of 2019. I am so excited. I can't wait for this month and for Christmas. This is my favorite season. So hopefully you are excited too. And we will have so much fun, I hope, this year. So we will go to Christmas fairs. We will do some decorating. I will show you how I have decorated for Christmas in my house so far we will wrap presents and we will just have a lot of fun and hopefully you will get in the christmas spirit and don't mind my sit right here i'm not sure what's going on i haven't had anything since i got pregnant and my skin has been very dry but suddenly i think it's a hormone issue or something so today it is december 2nd i was supposed to start this yesterday but the baby is sick so i had to postpone it until today so i just got home i've been christmas shopping with my brother so i will insert some clips from that in this vlog and yeah i also thought i would show you the christmas tree and the calendar that me and my boyfriend has made for each other so we have one gift under the christmas tree every day to open up and it is so exciting so yesterday i got this beanie right here and then i got another beanie and the day before I got the jacket that I really wanted for Christmas so he's crazy buying me that jacket for the first day in the calendar but I will show you in a second what I got I also need to decorate outside the house today so far I got this light show that is going on the wall it's so cool I picked up some lights today as well which I will show you in a second so I picked up this right here which has a light on so I will stick this down to the trees that I have outside and then I also picked up these stars which I will have in the garden and some lights as well. So now I'm just waiting for my boyfriend to get home from work so I can go out and start to decorate outside and show you how it looks but so far I'm really satisfied with how everything looks I just need a few bits and pieces when it comes to Christmas decor inside the house so for December 1st my boyfriend got me this jacket in the calendar I'm so excited it looks so good on and I really wanted to get this for Christmas but crazy as he is he picked it up for me for the first day in the calendar and then for the second day of December I got this Ralph Lauren beanie and I also got this beanie that I have on as well I really wanted to get a black beanie with a faux fur ball on top because I think these are so cute so that was what I've gotten so far and today we will open the third gift in the calendar so so excited but as you can see here we have pretty much gone all out when it comes to wrapping of the calendar so pretty much all these gifts under here are some christmas gifts but mostly calendars as you can see they all have numbers on and this is for today so i'm excited when it comes home from work we will make dinner and after 12 when it is december 3rd we will open our gifts and that's how we do it so yeah i absolutely love the paper that i went with this year i always go with gold you guys but this is kind of like a darker gold and these right here are so cute as well and the ribbon so i just love how everything looks so far so if you are excited for this vlog and excited for the holidays please give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you're new i would love to have you join my fam and also be sure to check out the giveaway that i have going on i will leave a link up here so you can just click that it will be open internationally until january 1st so you still have lots of time to enter so hopefully everybody decides to do that and without further ado i will now feed the baby and do a little cleanup in here and i will see you later
been feeling so under the weather and I finally got my voice back so therefore I would pick up this vlogmas even if I didn't get to vlog yesterday and the day before because both me and the baby had a fever and we have been feeling like crap and my boyfriend is also sick. That is why I haven't been vlogging so this week is probably gonna be a little bit short but I still wanted to at least vlog something now that I'm feeling a little bit better. So first I wanted to show you what I got in the calendar for the past three days. So on December 3rd I got these gloves right here and these are so soft, so cute and exactly what I wanted and these matches the beanie that I got at December 2nd so well and then I also got this Medical Medium Celery Juice book at December 4th and on December 5th today I got this Anthony William Tyrod healing book as well and I love his book. I'm not sure if you are familiar with him at all but as most of you may know if you have been following me for a very long time is that I have been dealing with a lot of anxiety, tinnitus, and I've just felt bad for so many years. So I have been going to so many people trying to get an explanation for all my symptoms and stuff and everybody just seems to blame anxiety and nobody seems to have a solution except medication and I don't want to take medication for my anxiety because I know that it will not take the anxiety away, it will just make the symptoms go away for a period of time. So therefore after I found him and started to read his book, I think he has five books now, I have been starting to feel so much better and my anxiety has pretty much gone away after I started with the smoothie in this book. And so I'm excited that I got the newest edition as well, so I can read up and learn some more. But definitely check out, he has a free podcast and stuff if you are interested in some healing ways. And you can hear stories of other people who have suffered from anxiety and a lot of unknown symptoms that the doctor can't seem to figure out a solution on. Definitely a great way to check out. He has some great health tips and I've changed up my diet completely and I feel so much better. So I was excited that my boyfriend actually picked up these two books for me. Yesterday I started to clear up my closet a little bit. So I thought we could continue where I left off in the closet. Do some Clara today and I thought I would start with this drawer right here and this is where I have my tops and t-shirts that are not as fancy as those hanging over on the other side so I will just pull out everything onto the bed and then I will go through everything and fold everything back together. So that is the plan and let's get started. was the night before Christmas I was closing down for business In my little prison shop When the bell on the door Jingled once more And then time almost came to a stop but somehow I knew, and maybe so did you, that everything would change from now on. Yes, from this Christmas on, this Christmas on. just filled this whole Ikea bag filled with clothes so I feel like I've done a pretty good job 
when it comes to the cluttering in the closet. And also if you will look in the drawers, you can now see that everything is nicely organized and I still have a lot of room. So I changed up how I store my knitted sweaters or more thicker sweaters compared to the other ones. So as you can see, I still have some space right here as well. So I only have my purses left. When it comes to this part of the closet right here, I still have a lot of space. As you can see, I can move the hangers into the sides and I can fit the double of amount of clothing. So here I have my more finer t-shirts and tops and up here I have all my nicer sweaters like turtleneck sweaters or more like formal wear and when it comes to my blazers I have a lot as you can see but I feel like I decluttered this once I moved in here so I'm not gonna declutter my blazers for now hey guys and happy December 11th so I know I haven't vlogged for a couple of days now because I have been sick, my throat has been hurting and I felt so under the weather. I am waking up with a rusty voice and you can probably hear it still, my voice is not 100%. So today I just recently got home from a meeting which I can't tell you anything about yet, it is a secret. But I will tell you as soon as I'm able to tell you. But let's just say 2020 is going to be an amazing year. Anyway, I just got home and this will be the last day of this vlogmas because I really want to get a video out. So I thought I would go around the house now and show you some of the decor that I have put up for the holidays. And also wrap in some gifts. And that will pretty much finish off this vlog. And then the next week's vlogmas, I am planning on going to the Christmas fair. We are going to the gingerbread town that is in the center, which is the world's biggest town of gingerbread. Like people all around the town make houses, there's trains and all that. So I thought it would be fun to take you guys with me there. This vlog has been all about decluttering, organizing, getting the house together for Christmas. But hopefully you enjoy that as well. So I thought I would just show you around some of the decor pieces and also the places and tell you where I got the items and all that and then we will wrap some gifts. So I will start in the living room and the first thing I have is this Santa right here. I thought he was so cute. So he's kind of standing on the platform of this lamp that I have right here. And then next to this, I really need to change out the flowers. So I've moved this dresser over here and changed the shelf that was here and put that next to the Christmas tree, which I will show you in a second. So right here, I have this box right here. This is kind of like a jewelry box, but I thought it fitted right into this theme that I have going on here. And this is from a brand called Beverly. So if I find anything that I have and it's still available, I will leave it down below in the description. And then I also have this cute star on top right here and I really love the light bulb. And next to that I've just taken some leftovers from the tree next to this nutcracker and also this star. And this I got at a local furniture store. So moving over to this unit, this is where the TV is, so I didn't show this in my house tour. And on top right here I just have this speaker which I got for last year's Christmas from my brother. So this is like a Google Assistant speaker where I play music and then I also have this tray on top right here. And I really love this tray you guys. So this is from a local furniture store but on top here I just have these kind of Christmas presents. And then I have some candles. So these are the brownie candles from Ikea which are my favorites. And then I also have some from last year. This was a part of the winter collection. And then next to this, I have this sign which says Christmas or Xmas. And these, I'm not quite sure where I got them, but I got them last year and I've just tied some lights from Ikea around it to give it a little bit more festive look. And these I also got from Ikea and these are this year's collection. So moving down here I have these Santas. So this is like Mr. and Mrs. Claus and I thought these were so cute. So 
I picked those up at a local furniture store. So moving on to the kind of main area of the living room here on this bench. I just added some sheep fur and a white cozy blanket. Just because this bench is actually pink, I wanted to cover it up for the holiday and give it a little bit more winter feel. So that is pretty much what I did. On top right here, I have a bunch of different candles. And all of these candles are from Ikea. And then I have this rosé tray right here with these kind of decor nuts on. We have this Christmas ball which says let it snow. It is so cute and this is from Riviera Myself. And that is pretty much my favorite store when it comes to Christmas decor and also like things for the kitchen. And then we have these candles which says one, two, three, four. So these I got from Ikea pretty much three weeks ago I think so these are still available I hope and then we have this little snowball right here which says Merry Christmas and it has a Christmas tree inside so I wanted to keep that there and moving over here this is pretty much how it was in my house tour except from this ball with chocolate these ones are also from the Beverly Hills collection and I got them at the local furniture store and I really really love them especially this one this is new and I just can't get over how cute those are so I just filled this with also some leftover bulb that I had from the Christmas tree and also some lighting and I also put some lighting in here just because this looks so gorgeous at evening when all the lights are turned off so everything is pretty much how it was except from this pillow that says meet me under the mistletoe this is new and i picked this up at rosta which is like a local store so that is pretty much what's new in this area right here and then in this chair as well i also added a meet me under the mistletoe pillow and then I'm moving over to this part right here, which is pretty much my favorite. And this is where the Christmas tree is as well. And I absolutely love my Christmas tree this year. I have a bunch of different decor on it. And my favorite pretty much has to be these ones, which are from Riviera. And then I just have a bunch of different ones. And these are from all around town. That is how the Christmas tree looks. And I also have two red ones that made it to the tree this year so one is i'm dreaming of a green christmas which is a golf ball i thought that was so cute got it in new york and then we also had a starbucks i just had to add those in the windows right here i have these gold stars so i have one in this window and then we have one in this window as well and i just love how it looks especially from the outside then moving from the Christmas tree to the shelf right here, I just have some extra decor pieces. So that flower is the same as I had in my house tour, but I've also added these uh, snowballs, which were from Ikea two years ago, I think. I always stock up on candles. I had a lot, so I got those. We also have this Santa right here. I have these candy canes i just added those into the champagne glasses because i really love how it makes this area look so festive so cute so as you can see i love my gold and silver and everything is kind of like classy and not over the top so that is that area so moving over to the kitchen i just have this cute little teddy right here which sits on the microwave and then my coffee station i've changed up a little bit added some christmas napkins and also some candy canes in the tiffany cups so down from the coffee station i just have this merry christmas towel so next to that we just have some lexington heat protectors or i'm not sure even what what it's called but i picked those up in red because i wanted to have a little bit of red for christmas instead of the beige ones then i also have this towel right here which is from lexington which says happy holidays love that and then i also were lucky enough to get this one from my boyfriend in the calendar so i have a matching glove to the red ones over there 
Then in this window I have the second red Santa which says Merry Christmas in Norwegian which is God Jul. These incredible cute Christmas napkins. Then we have these stockings right here. Don't mind the mess in these stairs because that is pretty much my wrapping station at the moment. But my boyfriend has his stocking right there. I have mine which I got at Target last year or two years ago while I was in LA. And then we have one for the baby right here. And I have this garland hanging in the stairway. And yeah, that is pretty much all the decor that I have in the living room area. Hopefully I can go out a little bit later and show you the decor outside. If not, it will be in the next vlog. I also have something in my hallway and upstairs, but I will save that for a next week's Vlogmas. So I will now sit down and wrap some gifts and just enjoy the evenings. I will try to film a little bit of that and hopefully go outside as well. I'm crossing my fingers that it will stop to rain. We forgot what you came for And in the coffee shop just next door We talk for hours on end And somehow we knew That we'd find something true so sorry that I have been sick and not able to do all these Christmas things that I was planning on doing but hopefully we can do it in next vlogmas which I will start to film tomorrow when we are going for Christmas gift shopping so yeah hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and also let me know what kind of videos you want to see for this month and next month as well down in the comments if there's anything you saw in this video that you want to get for yourself please feel free to ask me where it's from i will leave all the links to the items that i can find down in the description so be sure to check that out also be sure to check out my holiday giveaway that i have going on it is open until january 1st and without further ado i love you guys so much and thank you for watching and thank you for spending the time with me i really enjoy that and i will see you in my next video on sunday bye guys mm.